Hey everyone, if you have rare coins you would like to sell, watch this video till the end and I'll explain where you can showcase them for free. So in this episode I'm going to talk about several super rare and valuable Washington Quarters, starting with this highly sought after 1932D Washington Quarter in Main State 66. The 1932D is widely known as a scarcer of two first year's keys, particularly in high grades. This piece exhibits delicate, largely flawless, satin surfaces with original luster residing beneath a thin veil of pale pastel toning. Only a microscopic tick hidden in Washington's hair is at all worth of mention, even if only for the sake of accuracy. The design elements are boldly rendered and the overall eye appeal is excellent. It was sold for $82,250 at Heritage Auctions. Moving on to this 1948 Washington Quarter in Mint State 68 Plus, intensely vivid quarter with CAC endorsement. This captivating superb gem really needs to be seen to be fully appreciated. The obverse is exceptionally vivid with full endowment of intense steel lilac, salmon pink and golden olive iridescence. The reverse is largely silver tinged yet enhanced by nearly complete halo of crimson-orange iridescence around the periphery. Certain surfaces are fully frosted and finished, and temptingly close to numismatic perfection. It was sold for $43,200 at Stax Bowers auction. Here is 1949 Washington Quarter in Mint State 68. Aside from superb aesthetic quality, these coins' technical qualities are all there, and then some. There are zero perceptible contact marks anywhere to be found, even with a glass. As you rotate the satin lustrous surfaces, the blues, golds, reds, oranges, and greens bloom in the light. The eye appeal is beyond imagination. It was sold for $43,475 at Legend Rare Coin Auctions. Moving on to this 1939S quarter dollar graded in mint state 68 by PCGS. An MS68 grade on this coin indicates that it is in excellent condition, showing almost no visible wear, with a full luster and no impaired surfaces or design features. This high grade also means that the coin is likely to be quite rare, as few examples exist in such pristine state. This attractively toned specimen was bargained for $23,062 and 50 cents with buyer's fee on January 29, 2023 at Great Collections Auction. Jumping onto this 1943 Washington Quarter with double layer verse, graded in Mint State 66 by PCGS and proven by CAC. There are few double die varieties known for the 1943 Washington Quarters, doubling is evident on the date and all letterings and is especially visible on In God We Trust. This premium gem has frosty silver luster and hints of champagne toning on a verse with brilliant and toned reverse. It was sold for $17,400 at Heritage Auctions. Here is 1966 Washington Quarter in Miss Day 60 Plus. The 1966 Washington Quarter is very common especially since over 800 million of them were struck. Examples in circulated grades can still be found in circulation. Even examples in about MS60, MS63 condition can also be found in circulation according to Jaime Hernandez from PCGS. In MS64, MS66 conditions they are a little tougher to find. It can be purchased inexpensively. In MS68 and higher conditions they are considered super rare. This particular specimen was bargained for $12,937.50 with buyer's fee at Great Collections Auction. And here is 1950 Washington Quarter with popular repunch D over S mint mark error, graded in Mint State 66 by PCGS. This important guidebook variety is much rarer in better mint state grade than its 1950 S over D counterpart. The upper loop of the S emerges above the over mint mark D. The minor strike doubling on the Denver mint mark is usual for the variety as is a slender horizontal tie break on the eagle's head. It was sold for $16,450 at Heritage Auctions. Thanks for watching guys, don't forget to hit the like button.
Do you want to sell your coins, paper money, notes, valuable bills and stamps online? You can publish your ads for free on our website, thecoinas.com. For mobile users, it's much easier publishing coin ads using our Coinas app.